why no boom lift? As you can see in this picture, these doors are not tall enough to allow a boom lift to get in there. These, this is standard door height, so that means they're eight feet, maybe a little bit more, but that's not enough height to get a boom lift in here. This deck is also probably too narrow for a boom lift to a maneuver around, especially at the corner um, where that uh, soffit kind of pops out. I don't think it's actually a soffit. Soffits are above head and I can't think of the right term. Additionally, the surface of the decking around the pool might not be strong enough to handle the weight. If it's tile or something like that, um, it could crack. The throw of the arm, you could probably only get to the center and then you'd have to bring it back down and maneuver it around. And that's like a pain in the ass. Um, you know, you might be able to maneuver it with it up, but with the narrowness of this deck, ugh, it's dangerous. You end up in the pool. What they've got going on here is a lot more flexible in terms of moving. Um, they can just stay up the whole time and kind of maneuver where they need to be uh, by pulling on the beams and this the architecture of the ceiling. Cherry pickers take up a lot of room to store. You have to get special training to use them. So this facility would probably rent one. And that means also hiring an operator as these probably aren't trained into how to do it. Um, this scissor lift compacts down and then you can store it in a hallway. So that's a lot easier. It's a lot more economical. Oh my God, one quick thing. College has a tradition of performing a prank before we turn in our theses. Um, thesis is my freshman year. They kidnapped the vice president of the college and they had to make the president swim across the pool onto one of these platforms when the vice president was tied up in a chair uh to rescue him and uh, on the way he was fighting off people with like pool noodles and um those big foam things like from american gladiators and um then he had to get there untie him and swim him back across again fighting off all those people <gasps> oh this is a good time um my senior year, we put him on trial for war crimes and lying to the American people about ma uh, weapons of mass destruction. The best one was the year they made him break ground on the community garden, a project he vetoed three months earlier. <laughs> they still have that garden.